So this is my first year with the district and I think it's been especially helpful for me just to get used to the district standards and the expectations for instruction. And for me, it's been very helpful with improving my practice because I've had extra support in the classroom and it's really helped me to get redirected at times or get some feedback. Um, I feel like I just have a lot more support with people coming in and being able to kind of debrief with me about questions I have or things they've noticed that I haven't. It has helped me align my practice and it also has helped um, the, the, the new teacher standards are really aligned to the new Common Core. So we're looking, the descriptions there really help to um, identify or to define what it is that we're looking for in, in teacher practice. So that helps in the conversations that we have with, um, that I have with teachers in uh, talking about lessons and also evaluating or um, post observations. So I think one of the best things about this pilot uh, for growth is that you have lots of people putting input into your practice and really helping you constantly think about goals you have. Not as subjective. Um, I think it's pretty objective because people come in at the beginning of the year and they see they're observing you around a specific goal and then they come at the end of throughout and at the end of the year and it's it's looking at growth it's growth based as opposed to just overall how are you as a teacher which I think can be very subjective um, so I think in terms of that there's definitely a lot of support around a growth mentality the pilot this year has been great. It's been really helpful um, to improving my practice. This is the first time that I've had um, the uh, opportunity to be observed multiple times um, and by a former teacher and the feedback has um, really helped me grow. Um, so being able to set reachable goals helped. And then walking through kind of like each step of the goal setting with someone else who could support me and kind of offer feedback and suggestions for how I could meet my goals. Um, coupled with observations and kind of like that sort of ranking me on the rubric helped me to kind of move step by step and be able to reach the goal by the end of the year, the conclusion of the program. Um, well, uh, the pilot supports uh, growth and development um, because you can clearly see what you need to improve on um, based on the rubric. Um, it's really easy to read and really easy to see how you can move from one part to the other. It makes me feel like um like people know what I'm doing and I felt appreciated in the process. Um, so it's very different. It's, it's like the whole cycle of inquiry, it felt like, it versus come, you know, come in, observe, hear you're doing well, see you later. You know, and I like the rubric that we used too, so that was helpful um, in terms of knowing where you are allows more people to participate. So in the past, it was just me going in to observe classrooms uh, and having the pre and the post observation conferences with teachers. Now there are two additional observers that do short observations. Teachers observe each other as support and teachers have an opportunity to um, reflect on their practice prior to the post observation conference. It's just been more thorough, um, I would say, is the biggest difference. Uh, it's been more thorough, it's been more meaningful for both of us. Usually it's, um, you know, this is what I saw, here it is, do what you want with it, or this is what I saw and this is what you need to fix. Whereas this one was sort of, it was more, you know, on the same team I felt like, like, hey, I'm here to help you out, let's both work together and see if we can improve your practice. It, seemed, it felt more collaborative, it felt more natural, um, and it felt really intuitive, the whole process. Um, because of the fact that you do have to schedule time to observe other teachers that you're assigned with, and then also uh, being able to have that time to debrief with them. So it definitely causes more problems in that aspect, but besides that, um, I think it's worth it. I, I get a lot of, out of the, uh, getting the feedback from the other teachers and my observers. I mean, the base rewards is that, for me, is that it it doesn't feel like an evaluation. Like, it doesn't feel like it's coming from the top down. It feels more horizontal, you know, more collaborative. I don't know. Honestly, <laughs> um, I, just, I liked hearing that I was doing well. 
that everybody likes praise. And so hearing that I was doing a good job felt great. Um, I would recommend using this pilot system because of the fact that I feel like I've been more focused and been able to improve specifically on one aspect of my teaching. Um, and that has a lot to do with focusing on the goals. Um, I think it is a valuable system. Still has some kinks, but I think they're working it out and I think there are more benefits than um, negatives. I think being able to set a goal and work with someone else to meet it. And I've seen, I guess, the best part for me has been being able to see the effect on my students. You know, so it really goes back to them and seeing them more engaged and how I'm able to meet my goals as an instructor and how that kind of transfers over to the way that they perform in class has been really great to see.